Hey everybody, welcome back to another exciting episode of Mystery Toys, where I open up two blind box or two blind bag items and see what we get. Today we are back because I'm having trouble finding new stuff, although tomorrow's episode I got something new, uh, to open up some more Kid Robot vinyl mini mystery figures of Bob's Burgers, the grand reopening, or a series two, whatever we're gonna call these. So I do love this show, although there are definitely some character names that I just never remember. That's just how I roll, because I'm really good at remembering stuff. And I guess actually we might as well do it like that. I think that'll look cooler. I don't exactly remember who all I got, so I don't know if I can spoil. But of course we can get Zeke, we can get regular size Rudy, we can get Tammy, we can get Gretchen, we can get Mort, we can get Linda, we can get Hugo. We got a mystery one. We got Bob Sifia from the uh, My Pony episode, and then uh, Bronconius. I can't remember how they're pronounced. I do remember the episode though. With Tina in that jacket. We got Jungle Bob. We got Underwear Jean. We got Marshmallow. I would love to get that one. We got Louise in the apron. And we got Jean as Bob, which I think is also totally adorable. I got these from my Barnes & Noble. And now we're going to find out what is in store for us. Again, with Kid Robot, they have tape and glue. So a little bit trickier to get into. Eh. All right. Can't do a lot of feeling here, although this one feels... Very interesting. Hmm. Did I get the special? I don't know. But we're gonna find out who I got, because I guess how it feels very unusual. Where's the tear point? It's here somewhere. Here it is. Oh, oh, okay. Um oh, oh, it's underwear team! Uh oh, it actually that's cool. It actually does come off. That's some giant underwear. And we get his flute. Yep. Was it a flute? Was it a piccolo? What is it? Or is that nuts? What is that? Steak? Okay, I do not remember this episode, so I don't remember what the reference is here. So you can feel free to tell me if you know. But this is really cool. And of course you do get a little articulation with these in the head and the arms. Not a whole lot. Just enough to do a little something with. But I love this idea that the underwear can uh, is movable and you can do things with it. Other than that though, it's typically just kind of a basic body. Kid Robot doesn't go all the way out of the way with the bodies. I think the South Park figures look the best from their lines, but the Bob's Burger ones are pretty cool. Let's see who else we get. That's a really good get. I and mean, what was his uh, numbering? So that's a two and 24. It's a fairly common for Kid Robot, but it's not so much about the rarity as much as it is the fun of having it. All right, again, I can't tell much from feeling, so let's just get in here and see who it is. That should be a clue, it's an inhaler. Ah, regular size Rudy, also 24. I don't know why I'm starting to sound like Zeke, but uh, yep, I used to have an inhaler that color. Actually, I think I got a new one that is that color. So I guess uh, his hand is that way so he can hold it. Eh, I guess that works. I don't, okay, I don't know how you're supposed to use it. But yeah, so again, that's the thing with the Bob's Burgers ones is I feel like the character designs are, are, they're great for the cartoon, but when translated to this style of toy, it's a little bit basic, not quite worth the $10 a figure. Some of them are, but somebody like this character, eh, even though I like this character, this particular vinyl figure, maybe not so much. But I did get underwear jeans, so I'm very excitedly happy about that. And now you can let me know, what do you all think? Do you like these? Are you collecting them? Do you think something else is better? What characters should they make that they haven't? What's your favorite episode of Bob's Burger? Who's your favorite character? All that kind of stuff would be fun to know, so definitely let me know and geek out in the comments below. Other than that, you can click the thumbs up button, give me the good old thumb of encouragement, as I do love to be encouraged. And now I'm gonna get out of here so I can go open up some more stuff, and I'll see you all later. Later.